You won't see any <laughs> snowflakes flying today, but there is still plenty of salt on the roads from last week's snow. You can hear it when you drive over. It's kicking up on the bottom of your car. Alex George told you earlier in the show, salt's not good for the body of your car. She joins us live again this morning with how you can best protect your ride. Alex? Dan and Lauren, automated car washes can be expensive. They can range from 10 to even $20. But as I found out, that 10 or 20 bucks can save you money in the long run. I talked with the owner of Christmas Automotive in Boardman, and he explained that getting your car washed regularly is a good thing. The salt can have damage, it can cause rust, but it can also cause damage on the underneath of your car. He said it can corrode brake lines and fuel lines, and that can be a really costly fix. Now, the uh, uh, Tom says you should also have your car washed every two weeks or after a major winter storm just to get all that sawed off. But he says you have to be careful about when you're washing your car. You've got to be careful. You don't want to get it washed when it's like below 30 because your locks and everything else will freeze when you come out of the car wash. So it's got to be the right temperature, but it's very important to get all that salt from underneath the car uh, off the frame. Now, the good news is the rain in the forecast today and tomorrow may save you a few bucks. It should do a pretty good job of washing off the salt, not only on your car, but on the roadways. Now, the other major problem Tom says he sees in the winter is broken uh, windshield wi wiper blades. He says a lot of times when the windshield is frozen over, people will turn on their windshield wipers and they'll be frozen to the windshield, but the blade will start to move it up and down. So he says that can also be a costly fix. Just make sure your uh, windshield is thawed totally before you start to turn those on. For all these tips and more, you can head to our website. WKBN.com. Live in Boardman, Alex George, First News This Morning.